Hello everyone, welcome back again to Mufasuket channel with AutoCAD basic tutorial. Today we will learn how to use uh, annotative uh, dimension in AutoCAD. First, uh, I will create a rectangle object in here with uh, dimension 50 and 50. We can uh, create a rectangle again. Okay, I will create a rectangle. Start from this point to this point, and start from this point to this point. Okay, this for a simple example. I will use a trim command to cut uh, this uh, line object. Now uh, I will set uh, all or create a new uh, notative dimension. You can tap D and enter. In here I will create a new, and I will give name in here a uh, notative uh, dimension. You can use a uh, standard with uh, ISO 25, and you can check this notative, and you can click continue. Okay. For example, I will use uh, this uh, default uh, settings. Okay. You also can change text line into horizontal, and you can click OK. You can uh, set current uh, this uh, notative dimension. You can click here to set current, and you can close. Okay. Now I will give a dimension into this uh, to this cat. You can tap a uh, dim uh, linear to create a dimension linear. I will click at this point into this point and move uh, to the top. It will be 50. We use a uh, scale uh, one uh, colon one, and I will create again in here. Okay, we will create fifty. Next, I will create uh, with scale to colon one. You can uh, change scale in here, and I will change into two colon one. We can create a dimension linear. Okay, I will click at this point into here, move to this point, and I will create again in here. You also can create from this point to this point. Okay. In here we have uh, two dimension but with uh, different uh, scale. This is scale uh, one uh, colon one and scale two colon one. If you uncheck uh, this uh, so annotation object, it will be only appear with scale uh, two uh, colon one. If you change in here into scale uh, one colon one, it will be appear scale one colon one. Okay, you can change in here into uh, two colon one. We appear at column one, and you can change again into one column one. It will be appear at one column one. If you activate uh, this annotative, it will show all uh, dimension scale. In layout, for example, uh, we can uh, delete this M view, and in here I will create a new M view uh, object. I will create in here. Okay, this is first, and we second in here. I will uh, double click at uh, this. Uh, M view and press F7 to hide curve. We uh, hide again uh, curve in here. Okay. Now, uh, for example, in here, I will uh, double click and then uh, I will use uh, scale for uh, these uh, models into one colon one. You can set in here into one colon one, and you can uh, click outside. Okay. The next, I will change scale uh, in this object into two colon one. You can click here and we change into two colon one. Okay, now it will be appear only uh, scale uh, to column one, but in here we change into uh, one column one, and you can see we have uh, the same uh, size of dimension, but in a different uh, scale of uh, this uh, to this scale. Okay, this is scale one column one and scale to column one with the same uh, dimension. So uh, this uh, function for uh, dimension additive uh, in uh, AutoCAD and enough today for uh, AutoCAD basic uh, tutorial how to use a uh, dimension annotative if you have any question about this uh, tutorial you can comment below this video and see you next time in another AutoCAD basic tutorial